A saga of the sea, grim and violent, and the immortal story of one man's courage are written in the heaving Atlantic, 300 miles southwest of Land's End, England. The 6,700-ton American freighter Flying Enterprise lies broken, helpless, and wallowing with a 60-degree list after a battering by the worst storm in 40 years on the North Atlantic. But aboard there remains one man who defies the sea to make his ship a derelict. 37-year-old Captain Henrik Kurt Carlson, after ordering his crew and 10 passengers to abandon ship, remained courageously aboard the stricken vessel, refusing to let her become a salvage prize. Finally, in tow, he is making safe harbor. It has been many a year since Europe's coastline, from Spain to the Scandinavian peninsula, has been lashed with a storm of such ferocity. Winds, sometimes in excess of 100 miles an hour, lasted for four days. It was such winds that rolled the sea over the shoreline and raised the mountainous seas that caused the Flying Enterprise's center plates to crack. But the seas could not crack a man's raw courage.